as time moves forward with NixOS, what happens is it, it still has previous versions of different files that you've got on machine application files that you've used to rebuild the machine or you've done downloads or updates, etc. And that can cause quite a lot of storage to be used on your machine. And at times, the best way to handle that, to get rid of that, is to do something called the garbage connection. And there's two, there's two basic ways of it. Um, there's the sudo Linux collect garbage, which if we run this, it will just get rid of some of the, uh, some of the files. Uh, and nothing to interfere with doing a rollback of your system. But let's say, for example, you've got 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, and your boot menu rollbacks. And you, you want to get rid of them permanently. Remember, there's no undo button here for the configuration. You would just sudo nix uh, collect dash garbage dash d to delete. So in this case, what I'm going to do is I'm just going to do a normal sudo nix collect garbage. Go run this, and you'll see here it's deleting some of the some of the stuff. So we've already on this, so we've already freed just uh, one point seven gigs. But again, if you, if we need to go back uh, at the bootloader, we can still do it because we haven't done a dash D. Are you only going to do a dash D? And then, of course, after that, a reboot switch. If you are 100% sure your machine is stable and don't need to do any rollbacks or anything, that's the only time you're going to use that. So as is often said with uh, with greater uh, power comes great responsibility. That is when you use uh, dash garbage dash d. Um, I'll leave a link to these commands uh, below. And as always, thank you for watching. Mm -hmm.